back working on the Bronco 73 since I last videoed I've got the uh, rocker panel all welded in I plug welded top edge and then ground it flush so my uh, weather strip will fit nicely I'm going to put that on and then up underneath up underneath you can see uh, I plug welded it from the underside these are the back sides but it looks like good penetration through that then back here, we got the upper um, quarter panel. It's all welded in. Went ahead and painted it. Keep it from rusting. Got to do a little more painting. So my goal today is to get the lower quarter which is up here in the back of the truck installed finish out this side got a little bit of work I left myself to do down here to get ready for that and I'm probably going to go ahead and that's all good metal but I had to drill and grind through it to get the um, the old spot welds out, so I'm probably gonna clean that up too. And I'll put quarter panel on. So that's the project for today. Get the quarter panel on. Okay, so we got the patch panel put in here. Um, it's kind of hard to see. I got too much light on it, I think. There you go. It's not going to be seen, so I don't have to grind it, but I am going to paint it so it doesn't rust. And then I can put the quarter, the lower quarter panel on. Okay, I've got the rear lower quarter mocked into place. Just got some tech screws um, holding it in for now. I already checked the uh, body gap. I mocked it up earlier when I had the door in. The gap was good. Um, got a couple tech screws back here. Holding her in. So I've got to drop it back off. Got to drill some holes up under in that ledge underneath to plug weld through. And then I need to punch holes down this side to plug weld through. And then I have to pull it in a little bit here in the middle. Just a little bit, not quite in all the way, but it'll be pretty easy to do before I weld it. Then I have to weld it. The plug welds I'm talking about are going to be through this ledge. It's kind of tied up in there. I'd really would like to see the spot welder they used in the factory to put those two pieces together, because this piece blocks you from getting to it from this side and this piece blocks you from getting to it from this side so it had to have been a heck of a spot welder but I'm just going to drill holes every uh, few inches and plug weld it it'll be as good as new well it doesn't look like I'm going to make my goal of getting uh, lower quarter panel on today. Uh, reason being the uh, 
looking at how it's put together I gotta have the corner welded to it and then install it there'd be no way to make the weld down through here if I didn't and that's the way it was done from the factory there was no no welds to this piece they were just the corner was welded to the lower quarter through this section and then it was all put forward and then I went ahead and took the rest of the old corner off and it was spot welded all down through here and then I did go ahead and drill my holes up underneath there then I'll be plug welding down through the top down through these holes here to attach that and then on the front it's just uh, welded down that came from the factory with spot loads but Got the uh, all the holes drilled in this front edge, so I can hold it up and down through there. But I'm waiting on uh, a delivery, so um, might spend this time to go ahead and cut that corner out. We got a new one of those coming. And I can get this metal replaced in here this all cleaned up ready for the new one and then I also have a new uh, front inner wheel tub coming so I can go ahead and get the old one out so I can stay busy